Many of us pass through the Borders Commons every day. Those who have, have definitely seen the mural, but few know the story behind it. So, to learn more about the father-son duo who created the mural, we sat down with Gary Kaufman. Well, I was kind of given some parameters uh, by the president and vice president of uh, what they wanted, and they wanted something that depicted the history of St. X and the buildings. So, kind of had that to go off of, but then we came up with this concept of uh, we had a problem of how to space all the buildings because um, we had an unusual shaped mural there right. because it goes down a set of steps. So it was kind of tricky to do that, but so we came up with this concept to put them all in the kind of a village. We had to do it over the spring break. So that was the actual painting a lot more that goes into it than that, um, particularly on that one with the steps that were so challenging. And then we had several buildings, um, but we wanted them to look at a, like a certain angle. So there was a lot of math involved. Um, so there was a lot of prep time on it. My favorite part is the uh, uh, St. Francis Xavier. Uh, he's uh, holding the cross. Uh, and it kind of looks three-dimensional. Uh, another one of my favorite parts is I hid my favorite teacher's picture in one of the windows. Uh, it's very small, but Brother James McCarthy, he was an awesome guy. Helped me become a man, and I, I love St. X, and I'll do whatever I can to help him and support him. And, and something like this is even better when I can do something I love and, and uh, hopefully improve the atmosphere and make it a nice place.